I'm doing one more VHD video because the uh, last one I uploaded directly using YouTube's uh, software and I found out it did not come out in uh, 60 frames per second. It came out in the more conventional uh, jerky frame rate, which I've never liked. So I'm not going to do it over again. Instead, I'm just going to uh, uh, do it just to show this again at the right frame rate. Um, if you're watching on just about anything, this should be showing at an actual, and that's my kitty, Greg. Uh, this will show at a uh, conventional live TV frame rate. If you're using the LG TV's uh, YouTube app, like like the one I have in my TV, then it, uh, at least right now it won't play at the right frame rate. But anyway, um, this is a prototype American disc. Actually, it may not even be a prototype. It might have been intended for actual production, but it never got off the ground. Uh, this one was still made in Japan. A few of them were made in Irvine, California. As you can see, this has a more full label. Uh, this does not come in a cardboard sleeve like the Japanese ones. It still has the window here to tell which size which. But um, I'm going to show the player loading again at the right frame rate. And it just goes in. The uh, Victor player has grabbed the caddy all the way in, but this just, uh, the caddy goes up to the edge. And interestingly, MCA was behind this format, even though they were a primary backer of uh, Laserdisc, and it was actually kind of shocking that they uh, put titles out on CED later, especially Considering, as, as much as I love that format, it was it was inferior. Let's just be honest with that. So let's let's show the unloading on this player, and then I will uh, do one more thing. So let's unload it. And I want to look at this in slow motion because I still don't quite know everything about how that works, how it grabs onto the disc the way it does. But something else I wanted to show is uh, there are actually three different types of stylus cartridges for these players. Uh, the one I'm using right now is a national player, and this is the uh, stylus cartridge that goes in it. Uh, the same exact same model as this is in, inside right now. I had another national cartridge uh, shipped from Japan and it turns out it won't work in this player uh, because it's uh, it seems to be the same but if you look at them from the side you'll see that one is a lot thicker than the other and the players I have um, use the thin kind so I still need to find a player that will uh, use the thick kind now so and there's no kind of number, model number, or anything like that on these. So that's that's pretty frustrating uh, when you're trying to hunt down uh, parts for these. For comparison, uh, the uh, Victor cartridges, uh, this is the box that the Victor cartridges come in. I'm not sure if the one I have was uh, brand new or not, but let's just show that by itself. Uh, this is the, uh, as far as I know, there's only one kind of uh, stylus cartridge that the vector players use, and the part number on that is VDS1100, so that makes them a little easier to find. In uh, comparison, I know of three different types of cartridges for the CED players, um, and being, being in America, at least, those are a little easier to find nowadays. But uh, I've, I've gone on too long. I'm going to finally put the player back together. And uh, anyway, thanks for watching it.